King's Rest. Nope, he is still here. I said you could pass, didn't I? Oh. Oh well. Anything in here? Nah, we already do have a shovel. Okay, before we continue on, I would say let's go for a long rest. Oh, the frightened ox here is still hostile. Oh well, at least we didn't kill him, right? At least the ox is still... Ah no, he's still knocked out. Oh well. Hey hey, thanks so much for raiding Kirito, and hello ah. raiders! Ah, let's hope we're not going to die walking through the fire. <clears throat> How is everyone? How are you? Hey, phone may die in two seconds. <laughs> oh no, Kirito, I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, and hey, Bane, how are you? And hey, Casey, how are you? <laughs> how far did you make it in Shimigami Tensei 5? I'm ready to watch another stream, but good luck. <laughs> Alright. So, long rest, I'd say. Let's see if we have a camp event, but I guess we do have one. Let's see what our favorite vampire wants from us. Uh, I also think this bloody ritual stain is going to stay just forever. Oh boy. There you are, my friend. <laughs> it's a sorry and drunk. <laughs> we can actually ask that. Well, at your service. Are you now? <laughs> Don't make promises you can't keep, darling. <laughs> Thankfully, I've had my needs met this evening. I found a bear. He took a little of my so blood. It wasn't Halson. I took all of his. You seem happy. No need to drink human or blood then. You're comparing plonk to vintage wine. You can make merry with either. But they're not the same. But Cazador fed me rats and bugs. And when you're used to drinking from a sewer, even Plonk is a marked improvement. That expression. Mm, oh boy, Asaren looks beat to hell. I think we all do. I think you just can't see it well on uh, the draw skin, right? And also the light is kind of helping us not to look up, look like so beat up. Uh, Shimigami Tensei 5 was great. We got the Habino Frost. Oh, nice! That one was so cute! Sounds delicious. <laughs> it was exactly as appetizing as you'd think. Still, that was the past. I'll never have to grovel for him again. It still didn't really tell us much about Kazador, right? True, you can start over. You can be better than what he made you. Exactly. I can be better than him. Stronger. More powerful. That's not what I More... meant. <laughs> oh. You meant be kinder. Pet bunnies, that sort of thing. I have no objection to being nice, of course. Once I have the power to bend others to my will. <laughs> Doesn't sound so nice. Uh, Asarion, we're still get, getting to get you to the good side. I think it will just take like a lot of time and quite some disapproval. But I mean, you are free now. That's what matters. Is it? What good is freedom if I'm always watching the shadows? No. I'll be safe when I'm powerful enough to grind Kazador into the dust. Powerful enough to do whatever the hell I want. Yeah, uh, I mean, then again, kind of Kazador having that power is what made a star and live quite the miserable life, right? Ah, oh, well. BG3 is a vibe. It really is. Really immersive game, really nice. Enjoy and hopefully your okay cave becomes good. <laughs> 
Ah, you're talking to Junipa. <laughs> oh well. You know, power corrupts. You do well to remember that. Oh, I hope so. A little corruption sounds fun. I spent yeah. centuries as the victim of a corrupt man. It was the Mind Flayers that plucked me away from that. They gave me a gift. The strength to take my own freedom. I'm embracing this power. You should too. But I mean, I can understand where he's coming from, just cause, I mean, for Starion it actually means to be able to, like, go outside and stuff, right? Oh well. Let's see if the others have something to say, but I don't think so. I mean, the last few days of long resting were quite eventful. You know, I've been catching myself smiling more lately. Aww. I think that's your fault. Ah, that's very cute. Ah, <sighs> yeah, that wine scene with her was pretty nice last time. I didn't expect me going for it, but it was pretty nice. Hey, Galak. Copper for your thoughts. Mm, okay, can't talk about anything. Maybe, Maybe for Sarian? Maybe we can ask about Casador? Darling, I was just thinking about you. Remembering our time oh. together, the things we've shared. <laughs> and I don't just mean that lovely neck of yours. I'm growing to like the whole package. Honestly. And you clearly like me too. So... So... I'd rather kiss a leech if they're just as attractive, but take less blood. <laughs> Ouch. That's rude. <laughs> ah, I'm kind of curious about the reaction. You know what? Life's too short to not go for it. We're just going to quick save. We're going to just say that. Because <laughs> I just want to see how shocked he's going to be, and then we're going to reload. <laughs> You know, I'd rather kill, kiss a leech. They are just as attractive, but take less blood. <laughs> Maybe there's more to you than I thought. Deny your feelings all you like. It doesn't matter to me. He doesn't I've dislike already it. tasted you, and that's all the carnal delight I need. <laughs> We're still going to load. But curious, it kind of seems to be like his taste of humor, right? Uh. Oh boy. Darling, remember I'm okay, let's growing be nice to like this the whole time. package. Honestly. And you clearly like me too. So Okay, I actually like that response a lot. I mean, he's definitely owning it, right? <laughs> what gave it away? I could feel it. As I was getting lost in your neck. Your little shakes of excitement. That was me fighting you for my life. It. Didn't you? You know, a gentleman never tells. You don't have to say a thing. I already know how you feel. Because I feel it too. We could take an evening to ourselves, get away from camp, get some privacy. Oh. I know somewhere quiet, somewhere intimate, somewhere we can indulge in each other. I think it would be more fun if we didn't look like we were wrecked by a train, but yeah. Um, why is Asarian so beaten up? It was a long day, it was lots of fighting, and I think Asarian has like 3 HP left or something. Asarian Romances are so overplayed. I actually never played it before. Like, first time I played, I went for Gale. Did you also play PG3? Who did you romance? I mean, Dialogue Option 2 definitely has a point. A less trusting person might think this all sounds very suspicious. <laughs> then again, I think the rest of our party would just go search for us, right? <laughs> oh my god, then do it. <laughs> I'm definitely planning to do that. 
But yeah, I played the game before, also streamed it before. But um, like now playing Dark Urge and also like uh, trying out a little bit of different options than first time. You know, that sounds pretty good to me. Wonderful. I just hope we don't have to wait too long before we can steal away. But once we can, I promise you a night you'll never forget. See you there, lover. But I mean, also knowing a little more about Astarion, it kind of feels like a weird way of like paying us back for letting him drink our blood, right? Or maybe also just like trying to manipulate us and like getting closer to us. Yeah, then again, our relationship is actually good. Okay, let's talk to the others let's and then let's go way. to sleep and hopefully regain some HP. Mm, I didn't have Sarin Romans run once, but prefer less like characters. What are your favorite characters? Like either favorite or like top three or something. Speak. Speaking about, in general, less like characters. <laughs> Why is Lazel so stern? Didn't we have her at like, at least like, fair relationship or something? Oh well. Mm, hey Will. You've got something to say. Oh. You know, what was it like being the son of a Grand Duke? Not so enchanting as you'd think. The poor tears, the cold wells. They were the blue bloods hosting the fancy balls and drinking from gold goblets. Fathers, the son of a blacksmith, born with barely a coin in the coffers. Oh, I think we listened to he that He made before. a name for himself among the flaming fist. Brave as Balderan, stubborn as a deep rofe. Daring, outspoken, but hardly posh. <laughs> I spent more time dueling with father than I did rubbing elbows with lords. Not to say I didn't develop a taste for good wine and the talent for courtly dance. Yeah, I, th I think we had that dialogue before. Not sure what's triggering again, but hey. Uh, probably because you rebuffed her advances. Might be. But then again, we didn't lose like approval from that. Oh, courtly dance. I'd love to see a demonstration. <clears throat> it's been a badger's age since I've twinkled my toes. A drunk ogre could put on a better show. Imagine a drunk ogre dancing. Sounds pretty fun to watch, actually. I'm very tempted to say too. You dance like a drunk ogre. That sounds hilarious. Come we in. <laughs> well, give it some time. Develop a bond and maybe I'll show you a move or two. I promise. Clumsy Oaf is well within my repertoire. Nice. Sounds like my dancing skills. Though, I think I could probably also do like the Drunk Ogre. Hey, Gale. I think Gale didn't say anything to us in like ages, right? What's on your mind? You. Oh. Curious that when, that he's the only one who can actually ask about Astarian being a vampire. I wonder why. Would have been kind of more fitting to ask, like, Will about that, right? Because, I mean, Will's kind of like the monster hunter. What do you make of having a vampire in our camp? We all have our burdens. One way or the other. Mm. Hmm. By telling about you, my friend. Okay, after that. Let's see if we're going to see our butler again or something. Oh, are we? Oh. Hey, soldier. You aren't asleep, are you? I'm buzzing, honestly. I couldn't wait to talk to you. We're really going to see, like, all the Roman seats now. How good life is. Quite an odd thing of like a tadpole in your brain to say, right? But I guess Kallax ever the optimist. You know, I admire your optimism, but is it that good? Yes. Soldier, you're saving me. Every time you speak my name, fight beside me, share what's yours. 
I'm reminded that I'm alive. Properly alive. Aww. And free. Oh, gods, I want to ride you to you see stars. <laughs> I love how subtle Kalak is. In that regard, just like so much the opposite of Gale. Uh, how do I let her down like nicely? Sorry, but I'm not interested in you that way. Sorry if I was a little forward. Ten years in Avernus and I guess I've forgotten whatever manners I might have had. Don't hold it against me. Unless you want to. Oh, even though she doesn't sound sad, she looks sad, like in her eyes. Oh. Dude, no, Kalak is amazing. <laughs> I am sorry. I know she has many friends. And I mean, she is a great character. I'm not, not arguing with that. My case romance is great. I've never seen it so far. I'm also probably going to go for it like in the future sometime. Maybe. But yeah. The dog holds a well chewed ball in his mouth. <gasps> we get the ball! Do you know what that means? When we have the ball, we can summon him. Hand that over. Alright. It's only fair that you enjoy it too. But if Aww. you feel like throwing it. I wouldn't mind that at all. No, I do wonder if, like, dogs ever think we also want to, like, have their balls and... That's not... No. Let, let's not finish that sentence. <laughs> that we want to have their balls in our mouth. Great wording, Ethan. <laughs> uh, great. My brain is really braining today. What was that about, like, making a compilation of all the greatest quotes? Off to a great start, I'd say. Let's pet him. Let, let's forget about everything. I am kind of tempted to write down those quotes, though. Yeah, but I don't have the time. A quote bot would be a good idea for sure. I think so, too. So, Scritch's ball. You know what's also kind of funny? Not only that you can like throw the ball for scratch, which is awesome. If you find it, here we are. Come on. Um. Um. Okay, scratch. I guess priorities. Fur. Okay, that was quite the detour. <laughs> Anyway, what I was saying is you can not only throw the ball for scratch, but also, especially if you're like playing multiplayer with other people, you can throw the ball at Maybe them. I should. And it's funny no. if you hit. What's that all about? Let's do it again. <laughs> Isn't it funny? Wait. I'm not falling for that, Luna. <laughs> Scratch loves to smash Shadowheart, it seems. Uh, oh boy. Okay, I would say... Let's go back to the adventure, right? So, the big thing is... Oh boy. It really looks burnt out. Everything is grey. Uh, the thing is... Where do we go from here? Well, I mean, so the Cathanky Patrol is pretty close by. I would say let's explore this part here. And I think afterwards we can go down and pay our favorite hack a visit. Sounds like a plan? Because I don't know, I feel more like visiting the hack first and then going to go for the Goblin Camp. Because I think the Goblin Camp is kind of like a nice finale for at least the above the ground part of that one. So, here we go. And why is Shadowheart behind? Allow us peace what am I to do? Shadowheart. This way. Oh. Uh -huh. Why can't they jump? So it is spoken. Dream and so is it. Oh. So 
I just wanted to say, oh, I really like that track, heart. and then it ended. Such a name implies yours is a difficult heart to find. It's not that hard to find. Perhaps any difficulty is more telling of you, Gail. <laughs> uh, he doesn't have a reply to that. I love it. Mm -hmm. Always room for more. That's a fun. It'd be nice to look back one day and see the stuff like this. Oh yeah. I mean, I guess for me it's also going to be embarrassing. I do see a huge dragon here. But yeah, in a good way. Oh, I have to change something in the overlay. Oh. Look at that beast. Seems almost too big to take flight. That was kind of a delayed response. In a lifetime without seeing one, and then they won't stop pestering you. <laughs> uh, I suggest we admire it from afar. You know, Gail, we're just going to it would walk be too much to right hope there. That's nothing to do with us, wouldn't it? Uh, but since we are going to encounter the Githyanki patrol, I would say let's take uh, Lazel with us. Uh, the thing is, who are we going to leave behind? Also, no suggestion on the sliders. Aha. Uh -huh. But they could be compiled and put onto YouTube or something once you have enough, of course. Oh, yeah, sure. Sounds like a great suggestion. I mean, not a suggestion at all. Sounds like a great statement, right? Who are we going to leave behind? Uh. I think with Shadowhouse's taste for Githyanki, it would be fun to have her in the party. Also for the Lazel of Shadowheart dynamics. And... As much as it hurts, I think we're just going to leave Gale behind. Just for a sec. But well. Okay, Lazel. Because I think Lazel would be furious if we went to the patrol without her. Speak. I'd like you to join me. You fill up. Dismiss someone first. <laughs> Gail could do with a rest. Ready for battle. Nice. All right. Yeah, let's see if we're going to battle the patrol. <laughs> oh, one of my favorite, really not important characters. What are you doing? Hold up before they see you, Magresham. I wonder what Magresha means. It doesn't sound nice. You know, I might have been concerned and had the slightest idea who they are. Look, down there. That lot are swarming all over the bridge. I don't know what they want, but it can't be good. I'm going to find another way around. You ought to do the same. It's of course, it's not going to be good. I doubt the fight against them would go your way. Hmm. Say, who are you? Nobody. Just another harassing fool trying to stay alive. There's plenty of us around. Oh. Yeah, that's sad. I'm not going to spot it before. Uh, seems you have good at survival instincts. You know, maybe if you join me instead. What? Just follow you around? I go my own way. Alone. Oh. But yeah, it's such a nice play on the usual, like, recruiting your companions. Like, why would I do that? Rag. That's it. I'm getting out of here. Yeah. That's why I think she's cool. But yeah. Not much to her. Drop your weapons! I'll feed your innards to the ants before I do that, Istik. This is your last chance! You yeah, no, so intimidating. Up. That was your last chance, Istik. Now burn! Yeah, red dragons are mean. And quite big. Stop wasting time, Beretta. You're not here to play with the locals. Of course, Kithrak. 
We merely sought to... No excuses. Question, kill, then move on. Find the weapon. Our queen watches us. Fail her at your peril. And what I definitely have to admire... I envy its knight. Their armor. Would that I rode such a steed. A crash must be near. Come, my kin await. Yeah, they're surely going to be thrilled to meet us. But I mean here, another point where you gotta say, Lazel for Githyanki is quite friendly. Look at like what the others did, right? Was like, you stay in my way, you die. And Lazel is actually like, hey, I'm going to take you to my kin. She actually tries to be helpful. The dragon incinerated those soldiers. Surely this isn't safe. The dragons serve Githyanki. I'll see it does you no harm. Follow me. We are close to the cure we seek. Oh, and she actually just leaves. Uh, well, he gets nothing. Okay, Nazel. Let's hope they're not going to kill us. Maybe let's quick save. Rider, my time is short. I really like Lead me to... Shh, shh, shh. Such a familiar tone. Were I not merciful, I would slice the skin clean from your meat. Yet you are not bleeding. For I am nothing if not merciful. One of my favorite name, quotes. child. Like Gathianki in a nutshell. And see, I really loved that scene, like the first time I played it back in Early Access, because it was like... I gotta say, in the beginning, first few times I played the game, I really dislike Lazel. Like, how cruel she is and everything, but she has great character development. And also, when you first encounter the patrol, you're like, Lazel's actually nice. She actually wants to help you. She's actually, for Githyanki, quite friendly. And I don't think she would ever forgive us if we would take the word here, so... Lemon and nods to Lazel. Uh, go ahead. Lazel. Lazel, proud, regal even. You will call me Gestil Kithrak. Vos, Knight Supreme, the Queen's Silver, the Queen's Sword. I am who you say. A gate Quite vessel has ranking. fallen from the sky, Lazel. Thieves aboard have taken a weapon most precious. It is polyhedric in shape and inscribed with the sacred runes of our people. You suddenly feel a strange anxiety take mm. hold. Not your own, but that of the artifact you carry. Somehow, it's afraid you would I just wanted to right. say, it sounds like something we have. The artifact or does has. not want to part from you. It does not want to fall into the Gith Raiders' hands. Take word to your crash. You are to join our search. Speak up, child. Affirm your mandate. Yeah. <clears throat> oh gosh, what's wrong with my voice? Okay, now I hope it's better. Oh yeah, it feels better. Yeah, I mean, I think being honest with the Githyanki will just lead them to kill you, right? They kill people for way less. Just look at the flaming fists or, well, look at their smoking remains, right? I think also if they see the artifact, they will take it. And they would also kill us for probably thinking we stole it, right? So, I think it never worked so far when I tried it. But let's try to actually solve this, like, with diplomacy. And Lemon the Mouse to sign and command to Lazel. Play along. Why can't no one cast Guidance? Shadowheart, where are you? Shadowheart is kind of not in the scene, right? Weird. Ah, oh, wow. 23. You honor me with this duty, Kithrak. I shall alert my caretaker with haste. Lazel, child. Deception Your fails. Lies and that's the thing which always happens Has for Vlacketh me. Has Vlacketh not demanded better? Vlacketh demands my purity, Kithrak. I was infected aboard a Geich ship. Oh well. By protocol, you must aid me. You were on the Nautiloid. 
Then you are a geich wearing gith Yankee skin. Bend your head for the sword. I have done no wrong, Kithrak. Our queen's word binds me. Beretha, see that her skull is split and her corpse examined on Vlakith's command. Charming. I will take word to the undying queen. Our search continues. A current of deception carries Voss's words. Wherever he flies, it is not to Vlakith. To Danos! To the sky! But I mean, where else could he go, right? And also here is that he doesn't think it's important to slay us himself, right? I mean, especially with the red dragon, piece of cake. Almost like he wants us to give us a chance, right? Yeah, I don't know if we can do this. Aha! They deflect missiles. Okay, again. Nice. Really nice. Throwing them back. Monk for the win. I'm not really sure if we're going to to be able to win this. Like uh, Marachana Juniper, like you wrote. Doing this below level five. Hello. Ugh. Gosh. Great. Ah, uh, hey, but a star in is. Well, now in the fight. Come on. Cutting words. Especially Sarka Refers, insanely strong. Especially with the accent search. And just one hitting a star Oh, gosh. <laughs> Look at how much HP they all have. I don't think we'll be able to do this. I'm quite sure we're not going to be able to do this. But you know what? We are going to try. Um, oh wow. She killed Starion for good? How often was she able to attack? Stab, main attack. Down to Starion. Starion's mind collapsed. Then attacked again. How did she kill a Starion with just like one attack? How did he get like two, like three fails for that? Um. Gosh. I think we have to reload. I think I think this is not going to work. Uh, when was our last save? Was that already during the conversation? I'm thinking about whether it might make sense to actually try to win this. But with like one dead and one down character. I don't think so. How? Let's reload. If we have to fight this battle, we have to start with like better positioning. She hit him when he was down. True. But even if she does that, that just inflicts like two fails, not three. That's what confuses me. Do, do, do. Well. What I would try to do is maybe to like buff Lazel, um, so that she might actually succeed. We must uh, Okay. What we're going to try to do is going to buff Lazel. But I think for enhanced ability we have to, we have to get closer. Wits and blades always sharp. Uh, yeah, see, we have to get way too close. When was the previous quick save? Uh, I mean just five minutes earlier. Let's go with that. Let's do that and let's try to buff Lazel for a deception. And if that doesn't work, we either try to fight, if this fight starts like off better, and if it doesn't, we're just going to go for uh, on the other first. Seems almost too big to take flight. Okay. To camp, leaving Gay behind. Huh? Oh, we can also use the long strider spell first, before I forget that. Mm -hmm. Me, 
Thank you. Okay, let's take Lazel in. Uh, the like on me. That's a well. Keep your distance, darling. This oh. Long on you. And Long Strider on Shadowheart. And yeah, then, let's see, I'd say. There's no time to waste. Okay. I'll go this way. So, we want Enhance Ability on Lazel. And we are going to use Eel Splendor, so we have advantage on Charisma checks. And I think we also have Extra Knowledge. Gain proficiency in all skills of a chosen ability. Let's do that also for Charisma. And I think that's the best we can do. No, that's not true. We can inspire her. Okay, that's everything. Okay, let's hope that this works this time. Need to find a way forward. We're just quickly going to skip through her dialogue first, so that nothing changed in between. Uh, I'm going to make I doubt a fight against them. Nobody. I, do. I go my own way. Rad. That's it. Another I'm book getting safe. Out of here. Cause I'm anxious. And here we go. No. Our queen. A red dragon. A crash must be near. Come. The follow. Okay. Well. I like how dramatic the music gets. Let's hope this is going to work. No, what are you doing, Lavender? Weird. Rider, my time is short. Lead me to. Shh, shh, shh. Such, Such a dramatic a music here. Too. Were I your name, child? You. I am. It is. You son, you achieve. Speak up, child. Okay. Affirm now we try to persuade Lazel. And I mean, we just have to roll a five. Thank you. I kind of thought I just jinxed it. <laughs> you honor me with this duty, Kithrak. I shall alert my caretaker with haste. Did it work? Did it work? Nods. Yes! Content with Lazel's nice. answer. You serve your queen well, well Truth. Take your slaves and hunt those who escaped the Geish ship. Take your slaves. They must carry the weapon. I fly us. now to Vlakith, our undying queen. She will see your faith rewarded in this plane and ours. A current of deception. To Danos! To the sky! Cool. I mean, you just skipped the fight, I guess. But it's still very cool. The issue is just that, like, usually Lazel is not a very charismatic character, right? But hey, we did it! Woohoo! You did well to intervene, vexed as I am to admit it. Mm -hmm. The still Kithrak would have flayed our skin and left our carcasses to burn in the sun. All for the sake of the artifact that we carry. The crash is near, this much we know. We follow the path forward and into the valley. No one, not even the ignoble still Kithrak, will keep me from my purification. Boy, Lazelle is all fired up. But since we just have her in our party, our relationship is fair. It's not good. But hey, it's fair. Ah, it'd be also good with Vastarion. Nice. Is that blood? 